Are you gonna tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply It's like that You're just gonna walk into my Hello my kings and queens, welcome to my channel Goddess of Whispers, it's your girl Karen and I am so excited to welcome my cancers back to my channel. I do want to let you know this is a general love reading. This reading may or may not resonate with all of my kings and queens, so take what does and leave the rest. If this reading does not resonate, please check with your sun, moon, rising, and Venus placements. Also, the energies or the roles in my readings may be interchangeable, so apply yourself as you see fit. Don't forget, if this reading does resonate, don't forget to click like, share, subscribe, and click the bell to get future notifications to know when your girl will be uploading another video. And as you know, my Cancers, your weekly does come with an extended so in the extended we dive deeper into the message so what we don't uncover in the first half of the reading we may uncover in the second half of the reading there's two links in the description box below one is a membership option and one is a one-time access option both options is five dollars the difference between the two is the membership option will allow you access to all of my zodiac sign extended reading so you'll be able to check out all of your other placements or binge watch down there if you choose to all right let's dive in let's see what the energies that is surrounding the collective this week calling on my ancestors and spirit guides what's the energies here what's the energies here in sun moon rising and venus to the highest light for the purest good what's the energy surrounding the collective what is it that they need to know what's coming in towards them in love and money matters what is the energy here 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 two cards what's the energy what is the energy what is the energy last shuffle thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you all right so we have all right, new job and new love, okay? It's coming in here towards you guys. So someone is going to be receiving a new job or has already received a new job. Keep in mind, guys, I could also be picking up on your person's energy as well in the reading. So someone definitely is receiving some type of new employment, could have started a new business here. Take it as it resonates. Could even mean a new promotion is the energy here as well. We have the next card is new love, okay? So with this energy, this definitely speaks of someone in love matters is coming in here towards you it could be new love coming in towards you or your person of interest okay so take it as it resonates we're going to dive into the energies and see what this is all about okay clarify further what is the energies here in this reading spirit what is it that my cancer need to know what is the energy surrounding the collective what is it that they need to know what is the energy here what is the energy here last shuffle last shuffle thank you thank you thank you all right so let's see what this is all right, so the first card we have is boundaries. Ooh. Okay, so someone in this situation set boundaries around themselves. That is the energy here. This is definitely an energy of teaching people how to love you and how to treat you here. Something that you probably tolerated in the past, you are no longer tolerating that type of energy. So if someone is coming to you incorrectly, you are going to cut them off. You are not with the shits anymore is the energy that is surrounding you okay let's see what other energies is here let's see what other energies is here clarify further spirit what is the energy surrounding the collective what is the energy surrounding the collective clarify further all right let's see what this is we're gonna get three cards from this deck guys in total What's the energy here? We have forgiveness. Ooh, this is definitely an energy that speaks of someone from forgiving a situation for what it is, you know, accepting things for what it is and releasing it and moving forward. This is about finding inner peace in situations, no longer feeling stuck okay or stuck in the past on someone is the energy here or this could be an energy someone comes in to seek some type of forgiveness from you could also be the energy surrounding this card okay but someone is definitely releasing something and moving forward okay no longer with the shit is the energy here that i am seeing what are the energy is here someone is feeling free okay releasing someone and allowing it to be free okay releasing that negative energy in your life and moving forward that is what i am seeing here thus far what other energy is here someone is ready for new love we have labyrinth is what i think it is guys i may be pronouncing that wrong but this energy speaks of 
being on a rightful path is the energy with this card. This card speaks of rediscovering yourself in situations, also to rediscovering your, your path here. This is about finding new truths about yourself is the energy. So someone is discovering new things about themselves here in this energy here, but definitely figuring things out as far as what they want for themselves in life. But taking a different direction is the energy here. You know, changing your focus, okay? And probably by you changing your focus, this is bringing you new love. So we have new love new job someone just wants a new start a fresh start is the energy that is surrounding this reading okay for my cancers okay what's the energy here what's the energy here what is the energy surrounding this reading what is the energy clarify further what is the energy surrounding this reading what is it that my cancers need to know what is the energy here what is the energy here what is the energy what is the energy Clarify further what's the energy surrounding the collective. What is the energy here? Last shuffle. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's see what the energies are. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so we have the star. Yep, definitely a new path. Ace of Pentacles, new beginning, new job coming in. Ace of Swords, cutting people out of your life that no longer serve you. King of Wands, energy could have been dealing with a player in the situation. Or this could be someone that's coming in here towards you with lusty type of energy. Maybe leaving something behind and moving on to something better. Be, with something that's offering you stability here. Because we have the Four of Wands. So you could be getting some type of commitment coming in here towards you. We also have the Eight of Wands showing up as well being someone here is definitely being more adventurous being more open to different things is the energy surrounding you maybe even traveling at this time as much as you can surrounding covid this could even mean excuse me guys this could even mean communication coming in your way i'm definitely seeing a, a, a transition here with the star card guys i'm definitely seeing this as an energy someone finding a new path this card speaks of opportunities being on a rightful path in your life hope spiritual guidance inspiration wishes coming true for you healing past situations no longer feeling stuck this is about contentment okay being in good health okay is the energy that is surrounding someone here you could have been dealing with an aquarius so take it as it resonates with the star card or maybe that is an aquarius coming in here towards you now the ace of pentacles so funny that shows up right this speaks of new goals new career new job raise promotion investment opportunities new income sources coming in here towards you so someone Someone definitely is coming into a position where they will be starting a new job or has already started a new job, maybe started a new business or will start a new business, new money coming in, honey. You are going to be very, very happy and very well off in your financial realm. We have the Ace of Swords energy that speaks of, you know, mental clarity in situations, but also to cutting people out of your life. This also speaks of triumph in situations and success. It speaks of new ideas, okay? And this definitely means new opportunities. So I definitely feel like whatever it is that you were cloudier about or what you found to be confusing to you I feel like you're rising above that I feel like wisdom is surrounding you right now clarity is highly surrounding you and you are in a new space and a new energy okay but this new energy that you're in it's definitely setting boundaries around yourself and no longer allowing someone to mistreat you we have the king I'm sorry the yeah, the King of Wands energy here. So this energy in this King of Wands energy, this is an energy of someone who is very assertive in situations. This person could also be very controlling, so take it as it resonates, but also someone who's very confident, strong-minded, has a way with words, fearless, fearless type of energy, okay? This person likes to take risks in situations, can also come across sometimes as self-centered is the energy has, as well, okay? Very, very motivated individual, okay? They go after what they want. This could be your energy right now my cancers take it as it resonates you could have fire energy in your chart so aries leo or a sagittarius or this could mean you were dealing with someone in this energy or this is someone that is coming in here towards you okay and my apology i think i call that the knight of wands before but this is the king of wands in this deck we also have the four of wands energy here so this situation could lead to marriage okay for you guys as well so take it as it resonates i definitely feel like commitment a strong commitment is coming in here towards you someone that is going to you know 
make you some type of long-term offer is the energy here whether that's engagement marriage take it as it resonates or just you know wanting to be exclusive in the situation i see adventure here for the two of you i'm seeing you being very happy in the situation i'm seeing you traveling i'm seeing you um definitely being more open to this person i'm feeling like this person's energy is bringing out this new reignited passion here for you i'm definitely seeing a fresh start okay you guys will be um very open with each other as far as communication goes at the bottom of the deck we got the two of swords and then we got the ten of swords you are in an energy right now where you are leaving any negativity behind okay so for some of you you could have been married to this past person that you were dealing with this is why you're setting boundaries someone was served papers here in the situation moving forward no longer allowing this person to stab you in the back over and over again taking them back you definitely are not speaking with this person whoever this was in the past could have been dealing with a air sign here very strongly with the ten of swords and the two of swords so air, um aquarius gemini or a libra here so take it as it resonates but guys i am seeing here you are moving past this energy okay so whoever this person is that maybe ghosted you maybe you ghosted them is the energy here you you are moving past it you are letting them free that is what i'm seeing here you're moving on no longer feeling stuck over this person finding a new direction to go in and i feel like that's because that's why this energy is coming in here of someone completely new coming in here towards you for some of you you are already speaking with this person let's go ahead and clarify these energies a little bit further what is the energy here spirit for my cancers what is the energy here what is it that they need to know about these energies that is surrounding them tell me more what is the energy here i feel like this king of wands energy is someone who is coming in here towards you okay very passionate very strong-minded individual okay is what i'm seeing here that's coming in towards you what's the energy here what's the energy here what's the energy here what is the energy here last shuffle last shuffle last shuffle thank you thank you thank you all right, so the, for the star card, we have the high priestess, okay, coming out. We also have the nine of cups, being happy and content in your life. We have the king of swords. Yep, you cut someone off in air energy, coming through very strongly here, but that's okay because you are leaving the king to be with your emperor is the energy here, okay? We have the eight of pentacles. This person is going to make an equal effort in the relationship. And then we have the nine of wands. I feel like you are not going to be um, guarded towards this person. This person is going to make make you feel vulnerable in the situation so let's clarify these energies a little bit further okay so with the star card we got the high priestess this is about secrets coming to light and this is why you are moving on a different direction or moving in a different direction being on a new path here in your life the high priestess speaks of secrets coming to light here or someone was hiding secrets but i feel like you found out about these secrets and that's bringing you into an energy of following your intuition and that intuition told you to move forward with your life here is the energy here you could be dealing with an Aquarius guy sensing very strongly the past person is an air energy Aquarius Gemini or a Libra here we have the ace of pentacles clarifying the nine of cups you're content your finances are going to be looking amazing you are at peace right now in your life you are in a space where you are seeking new beginnings and new opportunities and those things are coming in your way the nine of cups speaks of wishes coming true in material matters okay is the energy that I am seeing okay we have the Ace of Swords being clarified by the King of Swords. And then I say you cut somebody out of your life. Yeah, you cut someone off or they maybe cut you off is the energy here. So take it as it resonates. The King of Swords is someone who is definitely head over heart type of energy. Very cold and very detached is the energy here. This could be also be the father of your child. Take it as it resonates or mother of your child. Take it as it resonates, guys. But nonetheless, this is an energy about mental clarity moving past this person. So like I said, some of you are married to this person and you deserve this person papers in order to file for divorce or maybe they did that with you take it as it resonates and if you're not married you just definitely move past this person the betrayal and the hate as you can see the door there someone is walking out of that door moving on with their life tired of being in this energy where you guys are not speaking okay i'm also seeing an energy where you guys are in the same household and you guys are just not talking at this time and it's like what's the point someone is tired of it and is moving on we have the king of wands clarified by the emperor and like i said you are leaving a king to be 
with an emperor. Okay, someone is coming in here that is going to make life worthwhile is what I'm seeing here for you. A very uh, passionate roller coaster type of energy as far as fun and excitement goes. With the four of wands, I'm definitely seeing here and clarified by the eight of pentacles, this person is going to make the equal um, effort in the situation between you and them. This person is going to make you feel very happy, very loved. You are going to be in bliss with this person that is coming in here towards you. And like I said, very strongly here, guys, fire energy, Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. We have the eight of wands being clarified by the nine of wands. I feel like this is an energy of you finally, you know, releasing any negative energy. This is about being resilient in situations. I feel like this is a new motivation that is coming into your life, being determined to be happy here, no longer feeling like this anymore. And I feel like this person is going to change that dynamic for you is what I am seeing, okay? At the bottom of the deck of, of this deck, guys, we have the eight of pentacles and the five of cups i feel like you are now moving towards bigger and better things is the energy that i'm seeing with the three of pentacles this means partnering and coming together with someone and i definitely foresee that happening and this is happening for you after heartbreak okay the five of cups speaks of moving on from situation it speaks of loss regret grief feeling abandoned and unloved in situations but you are moving past it and into an energy where you are ready for something new you are ready to partner with a new beginning is what i am seeing here for you guys nonetheless you are going to want to meet me over in the extended we're going to dive deeper into this energy i want to know more about this new love coming in towards you what's the outcome of the situation what action is needed to bring this to fruition for you i also want to know too this new love's intentions towards you as well and what's holding this person back from reaching out to you thus far and do you know them i'm also going to get some advice from spirit so i'll see you guys in the extended my cancers till next time bye i guess you're back are you gonna tell me where you went all the messages i sent with no reply